has arrived now for our two main event fighters. Andres Virag of Hungary versus El Haji Endur from Senegal. To get us started, here's our pit announcer, Rodolfo Roman. And now, it's time for your main event. Get up, let's get loud. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man hails from Budapest, Hungary. Ladies and gentlemen, Andros Firag. And his opponent fighting out of the red corner. Hailing from Long Island, New York, El Haji Endor! Alan Abel is the referee. Oof, let's jump in there with the splits. Why not? Round one, fight! Round number one. Karate Combat is presented by Bitcoin Project online at bitproj.org and by Origin, DNA testing, personal oh. genetic analysis. Blue Opponent glove tape for Virag, red glove tape for Endure. Virag started with the right low kick, uh, gate Hungary as they call it, below the knee, but right away he got countered by Black Magic, so he has to watch out. Nice right high kick there, Marwashi Yodan Giri, it's what they call it in Japan. He saw the head kick land, but it just took Virag off balance as he was back against the wall. Oh. Hard low kick. Yep, and that's to the calf section. You got the tibula and fibula. The fibula is the tinier bone. Look at that. Foot sweeps. That's what he said he liked, remember? And he's using that right now. Again, five seconds allowed on the ground to stand up for Mabelis. Bouncing the step of Virag. The confidence with the low hands of El Haji endure. Relies on his quickness and on his power. Let's go, let's go. Let's go. Call for action. Yep. Nice job. Nice. They believe encouraging the oh. fighters. Big low kick again. You know, those are really hurting. Not good if you get a lot of those and you have to fight a tournament in one night. That's a problem. Short oh. right hand on the inside from Endure. Virage right back out, switches stances. Wow. Virage had a, has a great chin because that was a pretty good punch. Didn't even flinch. Stiff left jab. Can you see Endure slowly walking down Virage, using the angles of this four-sided pit? You know, the thing what uh, Virage is doing, he's the, the jumping he's doing, he should stop that. Because at the moment when he jumps and he sets off and then he gets kicked, that's when you're going to be taken down with that sweep from Endure, from Black Magic. Who is, that's, that's his favorite thing to do, he said. Virage circling out, looking for a better angle. He's actually stopping, stopped bouncing now, so that's a good thing. Door loaded up, pulled back the right hand. In the heavy forward oh. pressure, another right from El Haji Endur. Man, he's only coming forward. He's just standing his ground, Black Magic. Look at that nice front kick with straight over the top. Oh, Another low beautiful. Kick. There Just we below go. the knee. Look at those punches. That's it. I would go full blast. Big shots. Not the wow. end. Just the five-second count. Fight on, says referee Alan Abelis. Varag was in all sorts of trouble there, boss. Yeah, but Varag said before that he's known for his toughness, you know, so this can take a lot. If he keeps going like this and just takes the punishment and goes into the second or third round, it might take a little bit of heart away from his opponent. Oh, look at this takedown. But Black Magic is smart. He keeps holding him so he can't create space and distance that you need in order to punch. Will he just run through with a tackle? Virag just grinding heavy pressure there, and to your point, Endure limiting the, the offense from yeah, Virag in the top position. Closing stages, round number one of our main event. Andres Virag versus El Haji Endure. Oh. We are headed to round two. Nice. But you see, Virag, he's going to keep on coming. He's going to keep on coming. So it's all cool. Black Magic completely dominated this first round, and he can probably do the second one as, as well. But what if Virag is going to hang in there you know, and, and, and Black Magic gives him everything he can, but he can't really stop him. Is that going to do something to him mentally? That's always a big question in my mind. Let's take a look at some replays here. Look at this. Boom. Beautiful leg sweep. But of course, because he's leaning on the front leg, since his back leg is on the wall. And here, almost again, but since his back leg was not on the 
on the wall and his weight was not on the front wall that's why he didn't fall but this now on the front leg sorry this last one again once your weight is on the front leg and Second then they sweep down, it yeah you're going to go, gonna go down in the pit. let's go let's go in the pit in the pit so if you let's fight go. against the guy like black right. mama here like black magic Fight. you're going to have to watch out putting your weight on your front foot round number 2 Endure pulling back that kick. Can note the hand position of El Haji Endure. Nice. Oh, that was a really nice hard spinning right back kick. kick from Endure. Nothing yep. there. Short right hand from Endure. Again, Bosch, you see the heavy forward pressure, the walk down of Virag by Endure. Oof. Yeah, Varag came in with that right kick, but he didn't push it through. He's got he stopped on impact, and that's you gotta have to drive that power through in order to sweep him. Or have an impact. Level change from Virag. Trying to throw the right to the body. Good movement from both fighters. I like both fighters' distance also, and the way he moved Virag out of the corner. He doesn't let himself get locked up there. And the duck under the level change from Virag, trying to find a way in. And that's his way in there. But if I was him, I would go try to go for a takedown. Score, 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 right? Oh, Head nice. kick. And again, he needs to set that up. And it's almost when he connects that the power is off. He needs to push it a little bit more through. Most of the time when you kick with right and you step your left foot a little bit more to the left, you will have that effect. It will go through the target instead of against it. Another powerful low kick. Nice body lock there, takedown. But the referee stopped it right away because he was leading up against the, ce the fence. The ceiling. What the <laughs> heck? <laughs> I'm Dutch. <laughs> I don't know the Dutch word for ceiling, so you got me. <laughs> Took me a long time to say Eredivisie. Yeah. Left hand back to the inside comes the Hungarian Andres Virag. But you see he's doing much better in the second round here. I think his trainer told him to lean a little bit more on your back foot. Endure Boss cutting really hard angles and still the walk down pressure of his opponent Andres Virag. Literally cornering his opponent. Yeah, what you can do now, you can move a little bit to the left so you give an opening to the right for your opponent to escape. But since you know that, you can capitalize on that, you see? So I give you, I move it to the left, and I know that my opponent's gonna escape to the right, and capitalize on that by throwing a point or right at her kick. Step in right hand, big swings from Endure. Very impressive what Endure is doing, moving backwards while punching. That really needs great technique in order to pull that off. Bigger swings now from Endure. Yeah, but the Hungarian is hanging in there, look at that. Oh, he got hit with a big right. 10 Bronx seconds. Spinning against the fence, 360, now fully on his bike. Jackhammer shots. Seconds. Closing seconds of round number two. And that's it. There is the bell. Wow. This broadcast of Karate Combat and KOKO Sports Management is copyrighted. It is protected under the laws of the United States and other countries, and its unauthorized duplication, distribution, or exhibition may result in civil liability and criminal prosecution. So there. Okay, I'll stay away from it. I, I was going to build one myself, but that's, uh, that's over now. I'm going to ask him for permission. Okay, Endure got really pushed. He's taking his mouthpiece out. Well, it's the third round, so that's not an, uh, a weird thing to see. So but this could be the final round of our main event, but again, under our rule set of karate combat in conjunction with the Florida Athletic Commission, if it's a draw, if it's level after three rounds, nine minutes, one additional three minute round, the overtime round, but boss, by my unofficial scorecard, Endure is up right now, two rounds to nil. Yeah, I think so too, although the second round, I think Viraj did much, much better. It's, uh, if he can continue round that three. going up style, he might take the third fight. round. It's gonna be too late, but if he can connect with a big punch, you never know. It's Touch gonna be hard. Show of respect, right back to work. Right back to the bounce in this step of Andras Virag Boom. and another low kick. You see, but now he knows. Oh, look at that. A nice moving to the left there from the from Black Magic. Low kick oh. and the takedown. You see, and again, smart. 
You know, you see, you know that Black Magic worked on that. As soon as somebody takes him down, hold him. In the grounded situation, if one or both of the fighters' knees touch the ground, they cannot continue to throw punches. The top fighter can throw punches, the bottom fighter can throw punches and up kicks. Referee tells him to fight. They have to go. Oh, that's a big low kick. Why not send him? Lance landed flush. Another low kick. Yeah, that's that foot sweep thing that he likes. That's his favorite technique. He says, look at this. Completely yeah, dominating now. now. Separation by referee Alan Abelese. And time called by Abelese. But man, Rirak, he's right what he said. He's tough. He's hanging in there. He's not stopping. No quitting in this guy. Time call to assess the cut. Yeah, they can wipe it off. It's like a minute and a half left or so. I don't know what the time is right now, but I mean, if it's not dripping in the aisle, let's, let's continue. Yeah, it's cool. Nice. The cut in the brow. Back, back. Fight. Touch of gloves. The resumption of round number three. Will this be the final round of our main event? Oh. Or will we have an overtime round? Switch of stances again for Virag. Back to the center of the pit. And again, Virag came with a high kick, but his opponent moved a little bit to the right, and the power was out. So he really needs his foot footwork. He needs to change something. If he gives a right high kick, with a right high kick, he needs to step a little bit more to the left with his left. Back to the clinch. That will transfer the power through the target. Wide base stance now for Virag. Stalemate at the moment, Ooh. clipping right hand from Endure. Faint on the sidekick from Virag. Again, Abeliz calls for action. He needs more of that. Faint more. And every time when he wants, runs in and starts striking, he's not looking at his target. Another big low kick from Endure. Dura now baiting Virag to come to the inside. Closing stages of round three. In comes Virag on the slip. Endure taking full advantage. You see the kicks off of the wall by Virag. Almost scissor kicking. He hit underneath his own butt on the head. Did you see that? I hope we're going to see that in the replay. That was awesome. <laughs> like a hook at an angle around his own leg while he was sitting on the face of his opponent. <laughs> I love the pit boss. The I fighters do as well. They need to move. And especially Virag. He needs to go. He's, he can only win by knockout now. Endure fighting like he believes he is up on the scorecards. 10 seconds. Final seconds of round three. Quite possibly the final seconds of our main event. There is the bell. All right, for what I understand, they queued this up, the points that I was talking about. Watch this. Oh. <laughs> A reminder that Karate Combat is online at karate.com. Many of you are watching through karate.com tonight. And if you have not done so already, download the Karate Combat app. It's available now completely free of charge for all operating systems. And yes, Sam, thanks for the text, buddy. Both fighters now must wait to see if there is a fourth round in overtime round, or if there will be a winner determined by the three Florida Commission judges through the nine minutes of this catch weight main event. 191 pounds, Andres Virag versus El Haji Endur. Yeah, this, it's, well, I'm, I'm, I'm not a judge, you know, but Black Magic pretty much took this fight. The heavy forward pressure from Endur and under this revolutionary scoring system, and I don't use that word lightly as I am huge with rules and regs, 
there is more weight given to effective kicking than to effective punching, and that really shows the baseline of what karate combat is trying to accomplish, boss. That's it. Yeah, kicks. Focus on kicks. When you think karate, you don't really think about punches right away. Yeah, you think about punches, breaking boards, and all that stuff. But you think about the kicks, and kicks are slower than hands. So if you can land a kick, it's harder to do it than to land a hand strike, and that's why they count more. We're now set as we go back to our pit announcer, Rodolfo Roman. Ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds of action, we go to our judges' scorecard. All our judges scored it 30 to 27. For your winner, by unanimous decision, Laja Endor! Three rounds to none across the board, 30 27, and the unanimous decision win for El Haji Endor. Not a finish, but high quality nonetheless from El Haji Endor in victory.